Um, super neat. So it continues. I'm out here in Knoxville, Tennessee on day two of my cross country road trip. Apparently this place is voted number one in Knoxville. And I'm about to go find out. I like the looks of what I see so far. So I have just under an hour to shop and oh my gosh, look at the dresses already. I'm so into it. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, the bag, flamingos. Okay, let's go in. Fish. I love whatever this skirt is. I know it's new, but it's fabulous. Daisies and lemons, two of my favorite things in this world. Looks like. Oh man, awesome, big light. It's kind of priced accordingly though. Oh, and there's little spun chicks. This place is way bigger than I thought and it's also like loaded with kitsch, at least at the front half. Oh, I love that bag. Oh my gosh, wait, stop, look at these. Oh my gosh, $12 for both? Those are fantastic. I really want to do that. It would require a special box though. I'm not really well equipped for that right now. I don't know what this thing is, but I freaking want it. Oh my gosh, I don't think it's for sale. It's amazing though. So, oh, it is. No, it's not. It is. Elephant hair dryer. <gasps> oh, just kill me. Okay, but also like everything here is cat themed. Oh my gosh. Like literally everything is cat themed. Betsy Johnson. Oh, that's fantastic. I wonder if I could still make money off that even though it's not new. It's priced at 14. I kind of want to. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Everything happening in here is epic. Wow, I feel like I didn't leave enough time for this. What is that? What is this? 58 black and white sequin track jacket? Checkerboard track jacket? Oh, epic. Oh my gosh, look at this belt. Is that what that is? No. Cool, uh, key ring. Just kidding, I thought that was a belt. I don't know where I was going with that. Um, the bracelets are all newer. It's like I'm seeing stuff that I would normally pick up if I saw it out of place. But when it's all as fantastic as this, $15 with the chip flower, I can't do that. It's uh, a little overstimulation for sure, which seems to be <laughs> the theme of the last 48 hours. No surprise there. Shut the front door. Oh, it's so repaired though. Oh, it's so repaired and so broken, but it's so, so wonderful. Oh, okay. What about the dog planter up here? That's pretty cute. 20 and it's a bang. That's not as exciting. I feel like the bangs don't do as well as the planters. It's out of focus, sorry. Oh my gosh. $20, no! <laughs> It's missing its puppies on chain, unfortunately. And this is adorable. Um, 14, yeah, that's about retail on that. I have a feeling that might be the theme since I'm in the city of Nashville proper. Psych, I mean the city of Knoxville proper. <laughs> little, oh man, there's so many nice things. So it's just all a little close. Although I will say so far the prices have been reasonable. Very reasonable. Yo, what? Look at all this stuff. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so much fun. The Florida orange bell. I know somebody who needs that. <laughs> um, made in the Philippines. 
How much is this sewing basket? That is the question. 24. Oh man, I really want to get that. I feel like that would do really well. And I feel like people are going to be upset at me if I don't do it. Because it's, it's just not as old as I like to get them. It's a little bit newer. I mean, it's still vintage. It's probably 80s. Let me see if I can find a comp of some sort. That fabric alone is adding to the value, though. Oh, I kind of want to take a chance on it. I don't think I'm going to lose money, at least. And it's really clean. Yeah, I feel like I got to do that. Um, That's amazing. Is it shorts or a dress? 39. Stop. I don't need that. It's not even my size. <laughs> I cannot stress enough how up this is up my alley this place is like in all its glory oh my gosh and that is vintage that's amazing oh okay what about i'm trying not to shop for myself but i can't help but look oh and i love the flamingo earring holder 14 is probably about what i get for that after fees though oh my gosh and look at the hula dancer shirt like what dude <laughs> this place is awesome i know you guys are probably like yes we get it you like it there but i kind of just can't help myself this is just like normally there's like a booth or two like this not the entire aisle and i haven't even left the first aisle yet that's a weird not mr toodles okay but like seriously the whole place is like this wow I'm really glad I stopped here. Okay, what else? I need to focus on the purpose of me being here. Actually, forget that. The purpose is to have fun. <laughs> um, this is really neat. I'm getting really out there. I kind of feel like I've, oh my gosh, I want to be wearing this hat. <laughs> An orange polka dots, although it's from like, for like a baby. <laughs> I'm gonna have to put my basket down again. All right, let's see here. This is freaking adorable. Wing reglued, one hand missing. Dang, it does have a little damage, doesn't it? Wow, that's kind of epic. Um, look at this little baby with the cowboy planter. So cute. Oh my gosh, cow magnets. Are they cow magnets? Yes, googly eye cow magnets. People go nuts over these, $5. That's awesome. Well, I did have the thought to open the bag and make sure the magnets were there and some of them are missing. So it's an easy fix, but still, this is very sweet. Handmade in Poland. I love this. I'm going to get that. That's only $6.50. That's super sweet. And then the measuring chef. Is that what this is? A measure of cheer, it's like a shot glass bell. That's so funny. Turtle earring holder, 12. Oh, so much fun stuff. When I say the whole place is like this, I mean the whole place is like this. What's this cute little figurine? Oh, it's super broken, dang. I feel like probably a lot of these people sell online. That's just a guess, a wild guess. 28, yeah. Look at this vest. That's wild. It's all rabbit fur too. Um, I have to know what this little lamp is. Cute. Uh, also, I see a little faux floral basket. That's fun. You know, I like my Hong Kong plastics. $10 though. That's about what I'd get for that after fees. And I've had a lot of that stuff recently. Big old Brin's cat. 20. Look, the seahorses. Those are fun. $11. The back is not right feeling though. I feel like it's supposed to be smooth on the back. Oh, wow. This is awesome. 25. That's super fair. I feel like it's got a little bit too much wear for me. Well, I feel like this is definitely new, but it's hilarious. It's definitely new. It's so cool though. 18. 
Yes, there's so much cat themed stuff in here, but a lot of it is, oh, there's also just like a random cat. Okay. <laughs> um, you know, I always keep my eye out for good cat stuff because honestly, that's probably what I sell the most of. And uh, on June 30th, we're also doing the follow that cat train, which should be super fun. So I'll probably hold back some cat stuff for that before I pay any attention to anything else. I have to look at this dress. So fun. Oh my gosh, look at the big button. Neat. I am gonna beg this belt to fit me because I need a new one. And this is, thing is far from new, but it's also $8 in Epic. A little bit of a bummer. It was just a tiny bit too small. Hey, bibs. Oh, this is so fun. Oh, don't let me fall in love with a pair of glasses I don't have prescription lenses for. That's the last thing I need. And more stars. Oh, I had that. I had ones just like this. That's so funny. They're almost the exact same ones. Oh, a little ladybug. And that's real leather. How much do they want for this? $10. Totally fair. A little bit more than I'd like to spend on it for resale. Oh, Kate's bait. Rhinestones. Ah, yo. Cool. Um, yes, yes, yes. $26, that stinks. Because I don't think I could get much more out of that. I've never seen a pink one like that, though. That's really tempting. This is kind of a wild-looking piggy bank. $8. I think that's actually uh, not what I think it is. And it's new? Wow, someone's gonna get upset that I'm leaving this here. Unfortunately, at $45, I really don't think I can do anything with that. That's amazing. That's probably around what I'd sell for. Oh my gosh, and the giant fuzzy ceramic, that one's 40. Five, two. I love the dress. I love everything happening over here. Like literally everything. Like this is the kind of glasses I want so fun. They're similar at least. Oh, fun, fun, fun. Risque. Oh my gosh. I wonder what that may cost. Let's see. Oh my gosh, that's so great. I can't see a price, but I'm gonna go ahead and assume it's spendy. That figurine says a hundred dollars. Is that right? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, 175 May West 1940s chalkware. I can't even believe I just held one of those in real life. Wow, what's happening here? That's very cool. Mushrooms. Mushroom note holder. I love that, even though it's newer. I think that's quite fantastic. I actually think I'm gonna go ahead and take a chance on that, especially with the ladybug. Oh my gosh. Oh, they're napkin rings. Dang, I thought they were pins. This one's a pin. Um, you could obviously, um, well, no, I guess you couldn't. $5, I'll take the wooden uh, flamingo. Now what's going on here? I'm Mingo earrings. <laughs> That's what my boyfriend calls them. He calls them mingos. I think it's the best thing ever. These are fun too, $12 each though. Definitely gonna take this. Oh my gosh. So for anyone who's ever seen my pink Cadillac beaded sweater, this is uh, what it is, Michael Simon, 42. Yeah, that's totally fair. These go for pretty good money. Uh, it's probably a little big and I don't know how much I'd actually wear it. And I hate to pay retail for this stuff because if I get sick of it, um, I don't really. Well, I don't I feel like I would get $42 for that. There's ones that are way more than that. There's like a taco one right now. This is so fun. I'm going to try it on. You know, I just don't think I would wear it. And uh, I can't justify buying it for resale at that price. And yes, I did pay about that for my pink Cadillac one, which I'll never sell. And I wear all the time. This, I'm a little unsure how much you said to actually get out of it. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Oh, so, so, so much fun. 
Now, the responsible thing to do would, oh, I spent $48 in there and I'm falling apart. Now, the responsible thing to do would to go to my hotel, wherever that may be, and get ready for my whatnot show since it's five o'clock and that's at eight. But I saw an antique mall around the corner. I kind of want to check it out. Mm -hmm. 